another broken light bridge. So this is what's in the guts of these machines. Pretty impressive for someone who never took a class in alien physics. She's gone. Not a trace. Not a sign of struggle. Nothing. are up on the ceiling. What do I have that can reach clear up there? What are you doing here, Lo? I don't want you here. Something happened to Maggie. She needs our help. Then go help her. What I'm doing here is important. Hey, if we felt that way about you, you'd still be dead. You're the tough guy, Lo. You're the hero. Go do your hero activities and let me do the science. What kind of contraption has Brink made here? Come on, guys. Let's get a look at you. No! Go away! Give those back! I will, Brink. After you help me find Maggie. I'm not going to waste one moment on such a meaningless task. Yes, you will, Brink. If you ever want these life crystals back. You're a miserable bully, Lo. Typical military mind. Pushing other people around. Right. So follow me and do as you're told. Is that rational enough for you? Maggie, is that you? Are you all right? Oh. How can she be all right? She's bound up in that web. Brink. Unless we want to end up where Maggie is, we've got to get by this thing. The obvious plan is for one of us to distract him while the other one slips by. Maybe you are thinking better, Brink. You want to sneak or distract? I'll be the diversion.
Come here, you phlegm, carapace, slime faced, mucus brain, furry legged abductor of luminously intelligent but pulpitudinous earth women. Lo, you idiot! Why are you standing there? I'm still trying to figure out what you said. Move your silly buttocks, you fool! Boston? Where are you going? I'm over here. Don't leave me. At this point, I'm ready to try any damn thing. Where were you? This monster has me trapped. Boston? Where have you been? I've diverted some of the water from the falls. I thought some of it might flow through here and wash the monster away. Well, instead, the monster's got Brink trapped up there, and I'm still stuck down here. There's a grate down by Maggie. If you can lure the monster over toward him, then when Maggie unclogs the grate, the water I diverted will hit it like a fire hose. This is seriously your plan? Do you have a better one? Maggie, can you get the grate open? Has anybody thought of the fact that if it does stop water like a fire hose, I'm right here? That's a good point, Maggie. Hold on tight. How do I hold on tight when I'm unclogging a grate? That's why you get the big bucks. Do it, then. Just do it. It's only my life, anyway. Come on, you ponderous exoskeleton. You cocoon-eating lobster face, cave-dwelling, arthropoidal elementary sphincter muscle! Maggie, you made it. How's my hair? You're worried about your... I was joking, Boston. You know, like you strong, manly types do when you just about get killed. Maggie's safe now. I satisfied our little deal. So give me my crystals and let me get back to work. Brink, it's time for us to work together on... I said give them to me! Take one more step closer, Maggie, and you'll wish you were back with that giant lobster. He sure is weird. Now what? I've been getting the feeling that the ghosts want us to help them. As if they were stuck and wanted out. Stuck how? Well, the library console seemed to indicate that they may have left this world for another. What if they want to come back, but can't? I don't know. How will we go about helping, assuming that's what they want, and they wouldn't need us when they got back? Beats me. I'm just interpreting. Look at it, Maggie. It shimmers, but it doesn't seem real. A kind of light that's just on the edge of existence. Something like this. You'd think they would have written about it somewhere. They've written about every other phenomenon here. 
Robbins. When I called you before you were kidnapped, I was trying to tell you that it worked. I revived the alien. Was it angry? Glad? He didn't kill me, if that's what you mean. He talked to me, but I didn't understand anything he said. Maggie, we've got to find a way to communicate with the alien inventor. I know, Boston. He's the only one who can answer our questions. He's also the only one who knows for sure how to get us home. I never would have found out anything from the map room if there hadn't been all those engraved keys lying around. Almost as if they were left for us. Only intelligent beings would have been able to figure out how to use them. Maggie, that's the sweetest thing you've ever said to me. I meant any being over the intellectual level of, say, a baboon. Oh, now you're making me blush. Can you look at this inscription, Maggie? Does it say anything that might help? Boston, it exactly describes that strange field of almost light. What does it say? It's a set of instructions. Now it makes perfect sense. I just twist this. Everything's so simple when you read the directions. If we didn't know better, we'd think that island had been there for a million years. This island was brought back from another dimension. This island was brought back from another dimension. What was so important that they left us exact instructions on how to get here? Maybe that metal plate over there. That's the fourth one. If it's like the metal plates on Attila, these four should fit together in that triangle matrix. Yes, but there's no guarantee that putting them together will take us anywhere we want to go. You have the most cheerful thoughts, Ms. Robbins. If you had been abducted by a monster and then half drowned, you might be pessimistic too. But you lived, didn't you? And your hair looks terrific again. You sure know how to make a girl feel good. We'd better go find Brink again, in case these metal plates do the job. He threatened to kill me the last time I saw him. Maybe it would be safer if we leave him and send an expedition back to get him later. An armed expedition. There's no guarantee we'll ever get back. For all we know, this is a one-way trip. You're right. We can't leave him. He scares me, Boston. Worse than the monster. They're both just hungry for something. But Brink is smarter. More dangerous. We're smart, too. Let's go. That was a powerful one. Commander Lowe, can you hear me? Frank, we're looking for you. We've got the last of the metal plates and we... Listen to me, Commander. I'm trapped. I need your help. Where are you? It's near one of the light bridges. An arched bridge over a waterfall and then into a crevice in the rock. You must have been there. You're the one who's been turning on all the light bridges, aren't you? Hold tight, we're on our way. Hold tight? Very funny. <laughs> <laughs>